Tell me about your fashion. You look great. Thank you. Summer afternoon. Yeah, well, it's, it's, so summer, summer chic, summer yeah. casual. I, uh, I'm just rocking some comfy loafers and shorts. I wasn't sure how hot it was gonna be. I like pink. I like uh, I like to be a big dude rocking the pink. Pink in America is not as important as it is in England. In London, they love pink, and I'm really, really glad that you're showing the pink here. I love pink. Uh, white Calvin Klein undershirt. Okay. Don't even know where I got this. These I think are Ralph Lauren's. Okay. Nice uh, loafers. Watch is a fossil watch for my dad for Christmas a couple of years ago. Hats. Boxers or briefs? There are Alfani <laughs> boxer briefs. Okay. And I just discovered today these fancy little short socks that protect your uh, shoes from getting all sweaty and stinky. So those are all the tricks of the trade from uh, <laughs> Max Adler Fashion Advice today. Very good. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. Now, tell me about your skin regimen. Mark Hapka, an actor uh, who I shot a movie with last year, uh, introduced me to the wonderful world of loofahs. I've been using that with some body wash. What else? I use the St. Ives apricot scrub. Uh, that's always good with little, little moisturizing beads. Oh. I use some hand lotion sometimes when my hands get dry. Uh, that's about it. So tell me a little bit about what brings you here today. But basically, I, I'm here because of you know the role I played and everyone that I've met through that role, everyone I've gotten to talk to, and and just being a part of Glad Awards, It Gets Better, Trevor Project. I see how important it is that homosexuals need to be represented in media um, because I feel like the more it's talked about the more it's out there the more it's seen the more accepted it is the more people you know understand it and it's not such a uh, uh, you know homosexuality isn't this foreign thing or a taboo topic so I think the more that you know it's out there for all of America to see and especially cities not like LA or New York that don't see it all around them um, it's incredibly important because I really think it breaks down the barrier and it takes away any of the the mystery or the fear which I think stems from ignorance because because of the work that glad does and uh, and the fact that they're just out there and you know we got Doma overturned and and you know marriage equality is restored here and people can marry who they love which shouldn't even be an issue in the first place so for all those reasons I'm here to support that cause do you think your castmates from Glee feel the same are there people that are advocates as well that, that, like yourself absolutely yeah I know all of them are and have a good time while you're doing it and have a great time and have a good time and, and eat, eat. <laughs> and eat and drink and wear some loafers <laughs> good job yeah. thank you so much